what is the purpose of p by d value in the sap world so exact explanation what is the uh, reason for sap value no sir d by d value d value yes sir the lift okay so all right so you're talking about let's say this is the uh, disk area here and then you have got so seating area here if we call that with a d diameter d the seating area where the steam pressure will be acting to begin with because this is the area where the if that uh, valve is lifting see it's better i i actually show you the diagram first and then explain it usually for jme i don't think that should be asking this deeper but anyways in these technical workshops specially created for the merchant navy decoded family all your technical doubts related to iec engines pumps as a marine engineer or as an electrical officer are sorted then and there by chief engineer orvin singh sir with a varied experience of being a chief engineer a technical superintendent a educational trainer at anglo sir madam training center he has a right knowledge and yes that is how we learn that is how we grow let's just start see the sample okay so here this is the area the first of all this is the diameter oops this is the diameter on which the steam pressure will act and this is what it will b means uh, this is the area so this is like this is and then the steam will be coming out from here but now the you see the this is the opening opening here you can see the flow area then on the top you have got valve so valve is something like this now this forms an annular area so steam cannot come out from here because it is stopped there so steam cannot go pass through this so steam has no way but to come out from its sides all around but in the sides agree Yes, sir. So the steam has got a curved surface area of a cylinder only to come out. It can't come out of, of this top area because that is blocked by this disc. All right. So that means steam has only one place to come out from. That is a curved surface area of the cylinder. So how much area it was coming out from the bottom? It is this square area. Sorry, sir, circular area. Suppose the diameter is d here. So, what is the area of the uh, uh, area of the circle? For what is the formula of area of the circle? Pi d square by four. Pi d square by four. And what is the curve formula for curved surface area of the for the cylinder? Curve. Pi d h. Pi d h. Very good. It's pi d h. O pi r square into h. So we have to find the h height lift. You can use this. So see, both are equal, have to be equal because this steam that is coming out of this circle has to go out through this curved surface area. So now this should be equal at least. Lift should be this much. So then only it is useful. So let's cut it out. Pi goes by pi. D goes by d square. so what is remaining lift is at least should be d by 4 so this is where it comes from 
So that's the lift. A lift here at least should be d by 4. Correct. So if you're talking about the full lift here. Otherwise, if the lift is less, then there's no way, there is no point keeping this area also high. Because you're not making a full use of this area. So if you are, if you're, let's say you, you want this area this much, and you want this all this steam to go out, so the, you have to provide this much lift. Otherwise, steam will be caught, get caught here, still remain get caught here, remain caught here, and it is not going to come out and release the pressure. The main objective of the steam valve is to quickly lift so much so that it will release the pressure even if in the boiler firing condition. That means the boiler is firing at the full load. So the steam that is being generated, you have to release it quickly so that accumulation of pressure is not there. Otherwise, it will bust. What is the point of using safety valve if you can't release the pressure that is being generated inside? So, so that's the reason here. Any further question? A blow of pressure. Blow of pressure. Yes, sir. See, uh, uh, so there are two pressure basically you're talking about. It was the lifting pressure and setting pressure. Right. Because, yes, because of blowdown, yes, because of blowdown, it will not lift at the same pressure. It, it will not sit at the same pressure it lifted on. For example, let's say lifting pressure is 8 bar. It is lifting. Setting pressure will be somewhere, let's say, around 7.2 bar. So we have a blowdown of 0 0.8 bar. Okay, so you have to lifting, setting, or reset, you can say reset, and it's called blowdown. So these are the things you need to remember regarding the pressures. Okay. Uh, how can we change the blow of pressure, sir, in safety work? There is a setting screw given here. There is a ring given here. Okay. And you can turn the ring. There is a blowdown ring given here. Okay, sir. So, here. It is all around. It's not two places. It is all around ring. It's like this. Right. So what happens is you can lift this height of this ring up and down using this is threaded inside. And when you you just turn it, it will go up and down. You turn it clockwise or anti-clockwise, this will go up and down. So what happens is that it is closing this area where the steam can move out. Correct? Yes. Because actually yeah. the steam now it is hitting here, then it is hitting here and then coming out. Then steam hitting here, hitting here, hitting, then coming. So this is called lip clearance. So by changing the lip clearance, you can change the blowdown actually. So if the height you increase by more this blue line, this blue uh, ring, you make it a more height then the, you lift, your sitting pressure will be even lower. Got a point? Yes, sir. Huh. So probably I can show you if you have proper diagram anywhere given. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, seat retaining ring with guide. You see here that there is an arrangement to go up and down. Now it's not very clear actually here. But uh, you try and check some diagram, you will find this ring. Okay, here. Yes, so, I clearly understood. So you, you, you see here, it's written blow down ring. You can see that? Can you yes, see this sir, yes, blow down ring? So this is that ring yes, and you can turn it. There is a window here. You open the window on the side 
and you can turn this with this with the screwdriver clockwise or anti clockwise and then you can move it up and down so that will change your blood out pressure i hope from this technical workshop you must have got a little bit idea ki how this workshop works and why it is important for you to go through those dreamer package visionary package achiever package electrical package and never to shy away from investing on yourself because in the long run that is the only thing that pays so if you want faster promotions if you want respect on ship whether you are a marine engineer or a eto electrical officer these packages on merchant navy gold website are meant for you jai hind jai bharat jai mata